happy Monday, June 22nd, girls and boys. This is our last Willingdon Phys Ed salute to the Willingdon community. We wanted to take the opportunity to wish you guys an amazing summer, a happy summer, a healthy summer, and most importantly, a safe summer. So here are a few wishes and tips for the summer from the Willingdon Phys Ed team. Hello, Willingdon. I hope everyone's had a wonderful weekend. Of course, it was very, very hot. I hope you've all been drinking lots of water. I know I have. I'm sweating as we speak. So today's a, a little bit of a different message. I actually want to wish you all a wonderful summer. It's finally the last week of school. We've done it. It's been very difficult. It's been very weird. But I think that both our teach as teachers and as students, we've done quite well. And of course, we can't forget your parents. They've been very supportive as well. So I just want to give you guys all my best wishes. I hope to see you all next year. I hope you enjoy your summer, that you're safe, that you have fun, and that you spend some quality time once again with your family. Also, I want to give a special shout out to our graduating class, the grade sixers. I wish you nothing but the best and don't forget to come visit us. And of course, our beloved kindergartners, congratulations on moving towards grade one. So I am out. I will see you all next year. Sending you kisses and lots of love. Bye guys. What's up, Willingdon? So this is it. This is our final video of the year. I hope you've enjoyed our weekly adventures. It's been quite a blast. And I just want to wish everyone a fun and active summer. My one wish for you this summer is to try something new. So it can be a new sport, a new activity, a new book, a new food. Just try something for the first time. Go on a little adventure. And then you can tell us all about it when we see you at the end of the summer. All right? So be safe, stay curious, and, and have fun. All right? Enjoy the uh, warm weather, and we'll see you soon. Uh, me again. My safety tip for the summer is about water, how to stay safe in the water. I'm going to put a link below for parents and for you to read about how to stay safe during the water when you're going into a pool or you're going into a lake. Specifically, if you're going into a pool, one of the tips that I want you to remember is to understand depth and height. Know how high you are, how tall you are rather, and how deep the pool is. And you want to know if you are not comfortable with going into the pool and you cannot touch the ground. This is important for you to know because it will determine your level of comfort and how safe you're going to be and whether or not you need to go in with a parent. So, understanding how how, how tall three feet deep is, how deep uh, five feet is, and uh, understand how tall you are. So if you can see Miss B, I'm five feet four inches, and in centimeters, that's 163 centimeters, so I know that. So if I'm going into a pool and I know that I have trouble swimming, I might not go into an area of the pool where I cannot touch the floor. Remember, 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 please, 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 safety first safety first always in the water water is so much fun but it can also be very dangerous if you are not intelligent before you go in the water so check out the link below about water safety tips during the summer have an amazing summer i will see you guys tomorrow but from the willing then phys ed team we wish you a wonderful summer and we see you fingers crossed in september